McDonald's on over here. He takes oh, the hug. That's a poor kick. McDonald's got to get the, keep this in. He does. That's got to be a good kick. It's a beauty. Whoa. Bench diving forward. And he was pushed 50. over. Is that 50? Oh. No. <laughs> Come on up. Gee, it might have been a little harsh. Bench now. Oh. Short kick. There, there is, is the siren. siren's gone. And for the first time, we go a sub-30 minute quarter. We weren't expecting it, but the Western Region Football League wow, have really. hung on and won by three points in a thrilling encounter as the light fades at Witten Oval. The buying we had um, right through as far as the, uh, uh, from the playing group was probably the most important thing for, uh, from where I was coming from as a coach. So, um, you know, to get that again and then the support of um, you know, Chairman Selectors Tomsey right through to the RFL board. Um, it was just um, amazing that year and, and everyone was on board and I can tell you now we just had a ripping night that night uh, back at the pub and you know, even though everyone was from different clubs, um, they all come together for one cause and, and uh, I think all players in general love to be involved at the highest level they possibly can um, and even if it's for one game of the year. Um, I think most players should, should grab that opportunity if it presents itself and, and put your best foot forward for your club. And uh, I think representing not only the jumper you play for, but the competition that you play for within, um, I think is very, very important. Look, for me, it was, um, it was just great to get the buy-in of all the playing group at that particular stage. So, um, yeah, it was, it was really put together through um, West versus everyone else. And, and that's the way we approached it. And uh, I'll tell you, that year, everyone bought in. Um, we had some um, terrific senior experienced players within the competition that committed to it, like Tim Jenkins from St Albans and uh, Murray Boyd from Spotswood, Tommy Langlands from Spotswood, um, Andrew Panay from Werribee. Um, those types of guys just uh, performed brilliantly right through the day and, and led it first. We got up uh, virtually in the last kick of the day. So little Timmy and Andrew Panay just took them on in that last quarter. And, Play with the Western Suburb spirit. So um, I think you know this competition for a number of years has been put down by a lot of people um, in football. But I can tell you now, we're as strong as anyone. And uh, I think if the players recommit again this year, uh, there's no reason why they can't uh, give it a good shake.